I hope you are, you're all having a wonderful weekend. I wanted to do a video for you guys. We had a couple requests, so we're trying to do them for you all. And this one request was for um, the makeup from the Rihanna video, American Oxygen. So I'm going to do my own version of it, and I hope you all like it. So please keep watching. All right, so I'm going to show you guys how I did this uh, look. And as you can see, I already did the one eye, and then I'm going to show you guys how I did it on this one. So... All right, so first off, I started out, of course, I did all of my foundation um, and everything, but I'm going to show you guys how I did my eyes. So I am using this palette, and this is the Z palette. This is by um, Makeup Geek, and the color that I first started with is called Starry Eyed. So it's this color right here, this one, it's really pretty, so you guys can see it, beautiful color. So I just took a flat brush and I applied it, let's see if I can set this up for you guys, I applied it all over my lid but focusing on the inner corner. Okay, and then I take a, like a fluffy brush kind of a short fluffy brush and my next color that I am going to use is called Bitten and it's this dark almost it's almost got like a maroon color to it so I take a little bit of that and I'm going to really focus go into my crease and drag it in a little bit but I'm going to focus on the outer corner and kind of just in that little V area little circles you want to kind of drag it in the middle not go all the way in but pretty far almost all the way in like that and then you want to just make sure you're blending it out Let's see and then I take a flat brush taking the same color and I'm dragging it down like that and you kind of want to just go over that whole line because you just want to create one line there and then I'm gonna take another fluffy brush um, this one is a little bit this is a pro smoky crease Sephora brush number 31 and I'm just gonna blend it all out I'm just gonna blend above and blend in here So it's really simple. I just used those two colors. So the color that she has in the video, I'll show you guys the picture. It's kind of like this smoky, if you can see it, it's like a smoky burgundy type color. It's kind of hard for you guys to see it. But if you look it up, it, it almost has like that burgundy color to it. So that's pretty much it for the shadow so to make sure it's all really well blended and then what you're gonna do 
Actually, you can go back over it with the Starry Night just a little bit, just kind of in the corner. Put that in there. And then next, I am taking my Samantha Lashes. And Find those. You can use kind of any lashes that you're comfortable with. I just, you guys know, I use these ones all the time. Okay, and then the next thing I'm doing is I'm taking my super skinny marker um, in carbon black, and this is by NYX. So it's just, um, it's like a, it's a marker, but it's liquid liner, and it's just really easy to apply. So I'm going to just go over top of the lashes, very thin line. You just want to create first of all blend them into your lash line but she kind of has just a very thin line above her eyelashes so just to kind of darken that up a little bit and you can use any kind of you can use any liquid liner you can use gel liner even if you prefer that I just like working with this because it's pretty easy so just want to darken that up then next I am taking I'm just taking a taking just a regular black liner pencil and I'm just creating because the way her lashes are on the bottom she has them kind of clumped together a little bit so they're darkened so I'm just gonna create these little marks like this and I kind of love this look anyway it kind of makes you look like a doll I really I think it looks pretty see how it just created those little marks almost they almost look like lashes but then I'm gonna go over top with my mascara of course and try to just really darken my lashes and kind of um, bunch them up a little bit so they're semi doll like because she really didn't have a lot of um, she didn't really have eyeliner on the bottom but I'm just accentuating this look with the lashes with that little bit of liner to make it look like doll lashes see how already it looks like darkened And this is my L'Oreal Telescopic. So actually, on this eye, I think I need to create more of that look, but I think you guys can see. It should look more like this eye. That's how hers looks in the video. So, I'm just going to create a little bit more of that look. And then I am going to just go back with my flat brush again with that same um, burgundy color and just kind of 
actually I really should wait till this dries but I want to drag it down a little bit again you guys should I would <laughs> definitely wait till it dries but it's just so you know so you're getting that that smooth finish along your line so the only other thing I've done to complete the look I've used the um, Ruby Woo lipstick by MAC this is a really pretty red color and then I just used a red lip liner and this is just a cheapy one I can't even see who it's by but you can use any kind of red lip liner that will work and I kind of tried to do my lips similar to the way hers are she has that really defined cupid's bow and I also did a little bronzer so I used my Anastasia contour kit and I just used a little bit of the bronzer and highlighter and what did I want to do I just wanted to touch up this area with a little bit of concealer sometimes I have to go back over it after I've done my foundation and everything just to finish that and then of course with the setting powder on top so sorry the last thing that I forgot to tell you is I did my brows I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow powder duo in dark brown and I just filled my brows in with that and of course, like I said, my setting powder, which I didn't do, but just so you guys know, I, I will do that. So that completes the look. I hope you all like it. If you have any questions or comments, please comment below. And I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your weekend. Thank you. Bye.